Thank you for coming. Some of you are new faces that I haven't seen before, and some are regular faces that I know already. Um, yes, it is. We're here for the Viareggio tournament as well, but also it's the ongoing academy that happens all year round here in in Ovada, which re represents the School of Viareggio International. Um, I want to thank some of the guests that have come tonight. Um, they're going to you know, talk to, the, to you about their, some of their experiences and their role here with Genoa International. That's in some of the clubs we're, we're actually working with in the future. And um, that's it. I'll just give Fabrizio to say a few words. Fabrizio De Poli. Buonasera a tutti. Niente, per me è un piacere, tra l'altro, beh, a parte che è un piacere stare con voi, che arrivate da Paolo Italiano, non inglese. I'll translate. È un piacere stare con voi, tutti gente che viene da tutto il mondo, Genoa International innesca delle situazioni che alla fine ci confrontiamo con giocatori che cercano di arrivare da tutte le parti del mondo, tipo Australia, Indonesia, Canada, eccetera, eccetera. Penso che da parte mia c'è una grande gratificazione e soddisfazione nel lavorare con Assieme Morris, che è più di un amico, Alvut Manovic, che per me è una grandissima persona e l'altro gli altri componenti di staff tipo il mister eh, Gianfranco e, e Gianni. È un piacere inoltre che GIS dà l'opportunità di entrare a contatto, in contatto con altre entità quali Lasco, con Stefano, o altre conoscenze tipo Martin e visto che qui c'è il Genoa stasera Penso che per me è un'ulteriore gratificazione avete considerato che nel Genoa ho un grandissimo bel ricordo, anche se i tempi sono stati duri, ed è una società che stimo tantissimo che è rimasta ancora nel mio cuore. Ok, I'll just translate that. Um, thanks for being here. Um, in brief words, yeah. Uh, I'd like to thank the staff that we're working with, the names he said, he mentioned, and the people he has. And it's his um, honor to be working for us and to be working with so many clubs to help your pathways. Um, basically, well, that all summed it up in all these words anyway. So yes, I, for, I forgot a couple of things. But um, well, Fabrizio is our GM here, and he travels around the world, Singapore, Canada, America, he's traveling everywhere, trying to find talented players like you guys in front of us. So that's his main role with us at the moment, until we hopefully he doesn't find another Serie A club to be director at, and we'll lose him. Hopefully not. Um, okay, uh, Ivan, how's our head coach here in Italy? We'll just say a few words in English. Yeah, you can translate. <laughs> <laughs> yes, like uh, Fabrizio said, uh, it's really huge uh, uh, honor to work with you guys and to be told you coming from all parts, uh, parts of the world over here in, uh, in our program here in Nevada. And uh, I had as a head coach will uh, try and I'm trying to pass to you some experiences that uh, I've had uh, during my long career, let's say 18 years of professional career. Uh, again, it's a great honor to meet all of you guys with the different mentalities and everything characters to have you here in our program. Even such of you are giving me a hard time, but <coughs> never mind. Uh, like I said, I'm here to, to support you with all these guys, all this stuff, trying to show you some things and hopefully for all of you that uh, you will find yourself in, uh, uh, in one place in the uh, next period to come. So, you are always welcome. Thank you, Ivan. Um, now I'm going to introduce you also to a friend. Ask, uh, Ascoli is head scout of Serie B first team. He's a head scout of Ascoli. He actually came to Australia with us as well. I'm going to Stefano Carasai. Grazie. I'm going to translate for you now. <laughs> no, è veramente un grosso piacere essere qui ospiti del Genoa International Soccer School, il direttore Mauri Spagnello. Noi abbiamo avuto da qualche mese un rapporto importante che eh, ci aiuta a sviluppare insieme un progetto internazionale e questo è per noi un grosso orgoglio. Siamo partiti con, eh, abbiamo visitato eh, la, 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 
loro, diciamo, so che school in Australia, siamo andati a Singapore, abbiamo viaggiato, abbiamo visto quello che eh, questa, questa Academy produce eh, all'estero e soprattutto in quei paesi. Giocatori con una discreta qualità che sicuramente potranno essere e far parte di società come le nostre. Abbiamo già come Ascoli Calcio integrato i nostri gruppi a partire da quello della prima squadra che milita in Serie B, due giocatori, Liam Graham, un neozelandese, e un canadese, Marcel De Bellis, che sono nella rosa della prima squadra. E questo ci fa estremamente piacere perché significa che questi giocatori hanno anche le qualità per poter essere in questi gruppi che cominciano in Italia a essere dei gruppi molto importanti, al di là del lavoro del settore giovanile. Poi abbiamo integrato anche dei giovani nel settore giovanile, sono arrivati due giovani in primavera e altri due giovani in Veretti. E questo è il, il frutto del lavoro dicevo, che è cominciato circa due mesi fa insieme per guardare un attimo allo scouting e guardare un attimo anche alla crescita poi tecnica di tutto un po' il movimento internazionale e soprattutto australiano, e indonesiano e canadese. Quindi per noi è estremamente importante l'approccio a, a questo tipo di realtà. Ok, Apart from him coming to Australia and visiting the Singapore Academy and Melbourne Academy and Sydney, um, he is very enthusiastic about working with this company and us um, and players with some some potential to go on and become professional players. Um, we've got currently six players in, in our school in the last five months. We've actually got two players in the first team playing, playing sitting on bench on the first team and two Primavera players and two Beretti players. So the younger players from Canada, Australia and New Zealand and Australia. So there are boys coming through the system and they strongly believe in what we are doing outside internationally and uh, are helping us to give part of it. And he is here this week specifically, our guest, to hopefully choose one or two players of yours to go back with him next week. So I want to thank you the club for that and um, it's our honor to be working with such a as well. That's it. Okay, um, you must have seen Martin, a friend of mine, he's a, a football agent, but he also works, he's a right hand man of the director of who I met last week in Madrid, of Rajo Vallecano. It's a small club in Madrid, but a very big club. Well, it produces a lot of good players. And uh, he's one of the head scouts there and agent for the general manager of the club. Martin, English, English, no Spanish. <laughs> I don't speak very good Scottish. Plenty no. <laughs> Scottish. It's, it's really it's a big pleasure for me to be here and to have the, the opportunity to get an invite of him. I was watching the, the later game and we are here to, to try to work in this general international. It was a, it was a good experience for me when watching the game and, and working with a school like, like in general. I'm starting to do something now for the future and of course that if we can we can make some experience together some, and bring some players <coughs> to Spain can be great for Rayo Vallecano and also for, for the academy. Thank you. Franco, how he coach for Viareggio, do you have any words to say? Uh, just as a, as a, an honor uh, be part of this uh, organization. So no more is uh, over. Years. And uh, I know what's the one is his dream uh, to organize this for a long time, and he does a great job. I think uh, it brings a lot of people involved, professionals, so it's a great honor to, to give this opportunity to catch you with job. And hopefully, all, all you guys uh, appreciate this honor to be part of this Vierejo Cup, and hopefully, you can take your future from, uh, from this academy. Thank you. Okay, guys, the next person here is a friend. Robbie Thielo, he's Canadian, like half of you guys out there. 
He's been living in it for the last seven years. I'm going to let him talk to you. He's the goalkeeper for the first team. It's not easy for a player to stay seven years in one club, so it's a massive thing. Um, I know I as a player had to find 10 teams every year because it was not good enough, so I had to find a team every year. So he's a top goalkeeper, and um, it's inspirational what he's doing because you know, at 21 from 15 to 31, he's been here doing the hard yards and all, all I've doing, always seeing how he's been, never given up. So all credit to him. Um, he's a Serie A player. There's not much to say about that. He's a Serie A player. He'll be sitting on bench against Udinese this week, and we wish him all the best. And hopefully, he gets some game time. So I'll let him say a few words. Rob. Uh, hey guys, this is weird. I'm usually on, on your end of the table. And I mean, yeah, it's, it's been a long road, but uh, it is possible, you know, and, and that's the biggest part, you know. Uh, hopefully, I can be a decent example that, you know, a kid from Mississauga and in Canada can, can make it to a top club in Serie A. And uh, uh, you guys are really blessed. Um, you have a great opportunity. You have a great academy. I mean, great organization with Morris. Uh, I, I came over on my own, and, and I wish I had an opportunity to come over like this and, you know, see firsthand how it was. Before I came over, you know, I, I didn't know the language. Um, I, I got put in a small little city called Vercelli, where there's nothing but rice fields. And uh, but you get to see nice places. Vienna is beautiful. I mean, Genoa is an amazing city, incredible. And uh, it's it's been a long road, but I mean, you guys have a great opportunity. So I mean, just do the best you can. You know, give it your all on the field. And uh, you know, all it takes is one game to change your life. You know. And, one opportunity and that's it, you know, I mean, change your life, change your family's life, it changes everything, so uh, go out there, first and foremost, enjoy your football, you know, just play it and, and love it, you know, because uh, it's it's difficult, but I mean, it, it is possible for all of you guys to get to the next level, so I mean, I, I wish you the best of luck, uh, enjoy this tournament, it's fantastic, I played it as a young player, uh, didn't get to win it, you know, but uh, Hopefully you guys can do that and change that. Uh, but uh, yeah, I mean, enjoy this tournament. It's a great experience. So uh, best of luck to all of you guys. Thanks, man. Thank you again for coming. Give me a round of applause, guys. 